Hi, I'm Doug Baxter. I'm with Baxter and Associates Real Estate Services. We're going to do a really short but really informative series on how to make your house more efficient. I live in a 60s bungalow and when I bought it, it was very stock. It was, it was standard. It's much like a lot of the 60s bungalows still are around Calgary. I just made a number of fairly basic upgrades and now it looks like this. But in the process of doing that, I made it quite efficient. And in fact, I made it so efficient that NMAX tells me that my house is 28% more efficient than energy efficient homes. So that got me thinking, what, what? I didn't do that much. So I went and modeled it up. I'm an architectural technologist and I have experience with uh, building energy models for 9.36 of the building code. I've done energy, inner guide ratings. <clears throat> so I know how to find my way around these numbers. So I went and modeled up your standard 60s bungalow and I made the upgrades that I went through. And it turns out that you can save 68% of your energy consumption just by doing a number of fairly basic upgrades. In addition to that, our energy cost savings is 700 bucks a year and that's going to increase next year when the carbon tax increases 7.6 tons so it's going to go up to 30 bucks so that's another 75 dollars next year so we're going to do we're going to go through the series on how to make this the 60s a little more efficient we're going to look at the furnace we're going to look at the attic so we're going to look at the water tank uh, we're going to look at windows, LEDs, the, uh, temperature settings. We're not looking at the actual building structure envelope because that's too much to change. So we're going to go through those changes, make your house more efficient. We're going to make it uh, more comfortable and we're going to save money and we're going to save greenhouse gases and everybody wins. So I um, hope you stay tuned for, uh, for the series on energy efficiency. Please let me know um, if you have any questions or any feedback. Love to hear from you. And uh, please hit subscribe. And I'll see you around.